Hey there, Sheepdoggers, and welcome to a first look tutorial and gameplay for... <clears throat> I just realised that there's no, uh, there's no title, and I was like, it's something to do with Mars. I've been looking forward to it. I can't remember what it's called. Surviving Mars by Paradox, who, as you may know, I have a little bit of a crush on. Sup, Paradox? Make a Warhammer 40,000 game, please. Just saying. Just make something. Please. Uh, we're going to check out Surviving Mars, uh, and we're also probably going to be doing a seven-day series, Mars. maybe an actual series as well, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, so, let's see how Paradox does with this game. Because uh, Stellaris is still a bit iffy for me, so maybe maybe space games are their weakness, you never know. Uh, welcome to Mars. Everyone at Mission Control is impatient to see the rocket touching down and un unloading its precious cargo. Our remotely controlled eyes and hands on the red planet, the drones and rovers. Our goal is to secure a foothold for humanity by building the first Martian dome. This daunting endeavor will allow the brave pioneers, the founders, to settle on Mars and prove the colony is sustainable. But until then, we have to make sure the colony has enough construction resources, water, oxygen, and power. So are those construction resources or are those additional to construct? Oh, God, we'll find out. Mission sponsor, International Mars Mission. Commander profile, rocket scientist. Let's de designate a landing site for the rocket. A promising area has been scanned for resources. Select the rocket from the highlighted icon. Okay, the rocket. Liberty number one. Okay. Select it. Right. And picking a landing site. Pick a landing site. Ideally, this location would be in a large flat area near discovered resource deposits. So, I'm guessing... Here should be the rocket. Overlaps deposit. Okay. So, like here. I'm guessing. Okay, so we can go. We should. Ah, uh, no, please. I want to see the. I see the rocket. Start, there we go. Oh, whew. Okay, cool, 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 cool. We, di we didn't miss it. That is a fairly. I don't know. Well, that if that's a mountain, then damn. Tilt or rotate. Hold alt. Move the mouse. Zoom, overview, maximum zoom out, zoom out, or M. Okay, that's going to make things easier. Uh, permanent buildings are constructed by drones. Open the build menu with right click, or B, select a building. Suggested building, a large solar panel will generate electrical power required for other buildings. So, solar panel, solar panel. Uh, power, large solar panel. Put it there. Build that thing. Oh, we can zoom in really quite. We could. Oh, those are so cool. I thought they were just going to be like little squiggly things that you can zoom in too close to, but you can actually legitimately uh, zoom in. Drones are automated workers that gather resources, and construct structures, and perform maintenance. They're controlled by a drone hub rocket or RC rover, automatically perform tasks in the service area of their controller. Okay. Is this being built? Metals needed. Okay, so the the drones are going to gather metals here, and you can actually see the what they're carrying as well. Oh, they're just they they got arms, and they're just like, yo, what's up? Uh, they're not mining it, which is a little weird, but you know what? Acceptable. Perfectly perceptible. Okay, I'm yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking at this, and I'm thinking, oh, I'm thinking, oh. What's this? Uh, concrete extractors automatic. Does Mars have concrete? Maybe it does have concrete. Uh, but they still need power and drones. Place a concrete extractor near a concrete deposit indicated by yellow terrain. Okay. Uh, thank you. Hence. Oh, okay. Oh, that's, uh, not worry about that quite yet. So pause, right? So keep it paused. We have a large solar panel. Okay, hello. Is that... Oh, it's turning to face the sun! Ah! Oh. Must be connected to a power consumer. I don't know how I do that. Turn on off. Change priority. Salvage. Okay. Uh, so... 
can be manual acti activated to cut off power supply, wind turbines, sterling generator generates power, while closed the generator is protected from dust. Yeah, I don't know how that works then. Stores power. So we should put a power accumulator, like, let's put one here. Uh, and then what else should we build? Uh, connect power producers and consumers by establishing power grids. Okay, so we... There. Oh, we can't. Blocking objects. Are they already connected, maybe? Uneven terrain. Uneven terrain. Blocking objects, uneven terrain. We'll figure that out. We will figure that out later. Okay, so what we've got? Infrastructure. Drone hub. Controls drones and allocates them to different tasks. Recharges drone batteries. So, is there anything that says, like, hey, you should probably build this? Uh, we've got the build menu. We've got the map overview. Okay, yeah, we don't need that yet. Resupply. Okay, we can request stuff from Earth. Research of new technologies. Low G fungi. Fungi. Uh, low G hydrosynthesis. Uh, transport optimization. Let's go with that. That seems interesting. Oh, we can outsource it? Okay, this is interesting. Peachy will love this. Um, orbital probe. Immediately scan sector. Okay, no, we don't need that. RC transport. RC. We should get some form of uh, production. No, storage. Yeah, there we go. Universal Depot. So if we put that up here. It is hexed as well, which is quite nice. Oh, and do we get a mini drone? I think we get a drone with that. So where are they going? What are you doing? Going to pick up electronics. Okay. Uh, and then we should... No, no, no. Stop it. Stop it. There we go. Concrete, metals, okay, okay, okay. Uh, life support, we don't need that yet. What do we need to do? Exploration, select a sector to scan. Okay, that may not be exactly what we actually need to do. Let's uh, just, oh, what have we got here? Pause it. Colony overview, milestones, radio, oh. Ah! Main menu, photo mode, right, right. Uh, I don't know what my objectives are. I guess... Scan that sector? Yeah, scan that sector for now. Um, so we've got water. What's this? Uh, anomaly. Send an explorer out. Okay. Well, for now, what we'll do is we'll build a moisture vapor. Production, concrete extractor. We could put a concrete extractor down, right? Put it down there. And then uh, power. Power cables. How do we. We do like this. And then like this. And then like this. That's, that's giving them things to do, at least, while I figure out what I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe if we start get, I'm, I'm, I think our objective was make it so that people can live here? Make it viable? Possibly? So it's just random metal deposits about the place, which is kind of cool. Uh, it just says scattered metals, okay. Oh damn, there's a lot of metals over here, alright. How are we doing here? Scanning, 3%. Buildable area, 80%. Cool. Alright, um... You guys are getting metals, I guess, to build these? Yeah, they need one metals each. This needs uh, metals and machine parts. I assume, is that machine parts? Uh, 
delivering machine parts. Yeah. Okay. No, 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 no. Carry on with your whatever you're doing. Okay. So what's this? We've got a rover. Serves as a mobile base. Uh, it can be relocated. Okay, that's fine. RC transport used to carry resources at long range. Gather resources from surface deposits. Okay. RC Explorer. Okay, so we got an anomaly over here. We can go check out this. Let's do that while we're while we've got other things going on. I assume we've explored this. Yeah, we've explored this sector, sector F eight. Okay, cool. Not much of a tutorial, but uh, I'll count it because it told me things to do at the beginning. Not sure. It'd be more interesting if the uh, if it was like a thing to to scan instead of just like a symbol of science. But it's cool. It's cool. Must be connected to a power consumer. Yeah. I know. I, I know. This isn't built yet either. So wait. What does it need? Concrete. Oh, okay, so we're, we're about to start getting concrete, so that'll work. How you doing? Oh, it's going to take a little time. So, it's interesting. It seems... The first thing I'm thinking is, like, Civ, right? Even though it's not turn-based. Like, this anomaly thing. Uh, the kind of initial, like, set down and just start going and start exploring. and It gives me a, a tiny smack of Civ in it, which is, which is cool. Because even though I don't play it that much, and there are aspects of it that does annoy me, that do annoy me, do annoy me, uh, I still like Civ. I still think it's a good game. It's uh, solid, you know. Is there a way to be like... Drones, four out of eight. Uh, give command to move or repair drones. Call all drones. Select a power cable or another vehicle destroy this rover. I don't want to do any of those things. Although, what we should do is get a recharger going for the drones. Yeah, a recharge sta station. Let's put one of them like here. And another one here. Just have two for now. It doesn't take much to build them. Metals. Just one metal each. Okay. Do we need a constructor? We need more metals for that. And it looks like they're coming. Okay. Solar time. Sol 1. Uh, Martian days consist of nearly 25 Earth. That's cool, actually. Uh, no colonists here yet. But it's early days. Uh, orbital probe. Immediately deep scanning of the sector is not available. Interesting. I don't think I need an immediate scan, to be honest, not yet. Music's pretty cool. Might turn it down just very slightly lower. Yeah, I think about there it's much better. Okay. Sweet. Oh, it's it's because it's night time. It's because it's night time. It's just going down because it's night time. That's cool. And like all the drones have. Uh, I guess they're being remotely controlled, so that's why they need... Oh, and it is getting built. Okay, what do they look like when they're building? Looks like a dance. Possibly the Macarena. Hey, Macarena. No active research. Research complete. Oh, okay. Anomaly analyzed. Milestone achieved. Oh, uh... RC Explorer can analyze an... Yep, 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 yep. Come back. Uh, so we, uh, building not working, three. Why are they not working? One of building needs electrical power. Well, there's no power at the moment. So that's probably why it isn't working. Ex extract sulfurous rich regolith from concrete deposits and produces concrete. All extractors contaminate nearby buildings with dust. Interesting. And we scanned an anomaly because we're awesome. We got the transport. What's this? Okay, you know what? We won't worry about that right now. Uh, so, extractor amplification increases production by 25%, but power. Okay, we don't do that yet. Receive one time grant. New building. Fuel refinery. We probably do want to do that. Okay, 
Let's outsource. Are you sure you want to outsource research? No. I just wanted to see what it did. And then let's do the uh, biotech as well. Okay. So, there's water here. We need power and drones to service them. Okay, so how about we get the uh, water extractor. So we need it like there. 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 It's a little bit of not Why is this not getting built? Oh, because we need concrete. Duh. Duh. Uh, so, we okay. Doesn't work during cold waves. Pipes, transport, walk, or an altar. This is gonna get complicated and awesome. Ah, oh, yes. No production. Okay, so consumption is power. Maintenance is red. What it, red is metals, okay. And it base produces O2. Alright. Let's have a look at what we can build here. So recharge sensor sensor tower. Boost scanning speed. Okay, shuttle hub. Houses and refuels shuttles that facilitate long-range resource. Okay, okay. Tunnel. Entrance and extra can connect power and life support grids at different locations and elevations. Salvage. Okay. Power stuff we've seen. Production. Metals extractor from underground deposits. Rare metal extractor. Polymer. You need prefab parts for this building. Use a resupply rocket to bring more prefabs from Earth. Okay. Electronics factory. Prefab. Prefab. Prefabs. Okay. So that's fuel, machine parts, and electronics. Life support. Yep, there's a fungal farm, which we'll get soon. Hydroponic farm. Produces food. Research low G fungita. Okay. Consumes water depending on the crop type. Okay. Needs a workforce as well. Uh, storages. Uh, yep. Yeah, well, a uh, concrete depot wouldn't be a terrible plan, like here, I guess. Yeah. Don't know why it told us to do the. Mm, okay, it's fine. Uh, basic dome. A uh, small dome suitable for the early days of the colony. Okay. Uh, homes. Okay, so that's maybe stuff that goes in domes. Let's just. Okay, yeah, dome big. Dome big. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. And then I'm assuming, assuming that living quarters are like... Oh, actually quite big. Yeah. Uh, school, okay. So this is all dome stuff. Alleys. Alleys. All right, alleys. Statue. In honor of the founders of Mars. Is this going to turn into uh, the Expanse? Because I'm kind of okay with that. It might be a good idea to secure some oxygen and water supply before building your first dome. Okay. So we need an oxygen and water supply. So let's have a look at power and see what else maybe we can go with. So a few, maybe we go with a few more large solar panels and see how that plays out. Drone hub. Okay, this... Drone hub is a stationary command center. Yep, yep, yep. Suggested building drone hub. Okay, so we don't have a drone hub. So we should get a drone hub. That would be infrastructure, correct? Yeah, drone hub. Okay, so where would we want that? Probably, like, here? Like, here. Yeah. Okay. So, there is power enough for this. Which is good. How do we build more drones? Service area, status, refueling, gathering exports, waiting to refuel. Okay, so we have to refuel it. Uh, launch. Initiates launch, launch sequence the return trip. No, the rocket has to be refueled, waiting to refuel. Okay. Uh, automated mode. All right. Uh, allow for bid exports, change priority, and salvage. All right. This is interesting. This really is like... The, the fact that we have to kind of, you know, transport uh, the oxygen and the water and stuff, like, I'm intrigued. Get these built, get a little bit of, uh, what's this? Is this waste rock pile. Dump, okay, so we need a dumping site now. So that would be storage, probably, dumping site. Yeah. Okay. 
uh, unexplored sector. Ooh, okay. Let's put the dumping site back here. Let's put two down, in fact. There, yeah. Alright. So they're recharging and everything. Hopefully that will keep them running, which would be really... Oh, hello! What are you? What are you, you little muffin? Okay. Awesome. An hour is not long enough, I feel. Uh, but we will we will make do with an hour because we're definitely going into a seven day series of this. Uh, there we go. Like that, yeah. So hopefully this will get built soon. I have a feeling that that is concrete coming our way. How much concrete? One. No, no, concrete here. Concrete here. Oh, he's going underneath. That's fine. I thought he was. I thought he was going up into there. Okay. More concrete. Delivering waste rock. Okay. So we can store a fair amount of waste rock here. That's good. If it was like just like one square each, I'd start getting annoyed. Uh, daily production, 20. Stored waste rock, stored concrete. First shift, second shift. Night shift, consumption. Maintenance. Okay. Oh, and this is getting built now. Okay, so we've built enough... Uh, yeah, that, that's cool. Uh, so we should probably M to check this sector. Okay, 49%. That's cool. We don't need to expand quite yet. What do we need for this? Water. That Well, that's not the one. This. Uh, we need machine parts. We need concrete. Okay, so that that will be coming soon. And this is charging. Capacity is 200. I think the one will do for now, but... That's, I don't know what that is, but it is adorable and awesome. It, in the same moment. Okay. Available resources, grade average, all right. So once we've got the uh, the concrete needed, which it looks, is that? I can't tell what that is. I think that's uh, waste rock, actually. But... So cool. So that's all we've got here that we can see at the very least. Uh, we'll have to scan other areas. Drone hub. Drones. Okay, construct drone. Okay, we need, uh, you need drone prefabs. Drone prefabs are researched in drone assembler. Okay, where, where, oh, is, wait. Requires research. Alright. So, production. Research? No, that's not how you do it. What's, what's the button? H is research. Okay. So, low G drive. Drones and rovers move 25% faster. Uh, extractor, social, lots of crowdfunding. Research will unlock various benefits for the colony. Researching any technology will make a new technology available for research. Changing your active research will preserve the progress of the previously researched. Okay. All right. If this does become the expanse and it's like Mars versus Earth and, and then the, the, like other places get involved and, and that, that could be kind of fun. So we're slowly building up the things we need to build up. Um, it feels it, like maybe this is just me being, you know, over enthusiastic and stuff, but it feels a bit more real than other kind of spacey games. It's like, so far. May, may, maybe this will all change, you know, and maybe it will be silly or whatever. But uh, so far, it feels it feels kind of... Yeah. So let's take this cable. Well, that's, that's not going to work for me. Put it there. I think that will work. 
That should uh, spur some guys into. Is there a way to. Like, near. Mine metals? Yeah. Just have these guys mining some metals. Uh, sensors towers significantly boost your scanning speed. They also give advance warning for disasters. Require electrical power, power generating such as that thing that we told you to build. Okay. So infrastructure. So it is telling me to build stuff slowly. That's that's good. Um, we could put that here. Let's just chuck that down there. It's interesting that the drones don't automatically. Current straight status drones load drones. Okay, what would we? What about we uh, give command, recall all drones, select a power cable, service area. Okay, I don't. That's fine. I think all the drones are out and doing things. Oh, you can't click and drag. Okay. I was thinking we were going to be able to, but uh, apparently not. It's annoying. Maybe it's like something we can organize later. It's a little bit annoying that you can't just uh, order them to specific. You know? Okay. So, we've got the water pump. Uh, now we need to store water. So what we need is we need uh, storages. Nope. 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 Infrastructure. Uh, nope. 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 Not power. Production. Can't be production. Life support. Oh, water tower. Okay. So let's have uh, like one, two, two. Let's have two water towers. And then we need a pipe. That goes to here. There we go. They're all gathering metal for me because I wanted to get a, a bonus of metal. And how is this scanner doing? On! Boost scanning speed, especially for nearby sectors. Building's not working. Well, that would be the power going out. We were expecting that. Never fear. Uh, the scan is on 91%. Buildable area, 80%. And sensor tower boost, 350 Okay, so the sensor tower is very useful for that. We will definitely need other ways of power. Uh, a wind turbine? It doesn't seem. Increased production during dust storms and at high elevations. So, can we maybe put it, like, up here? Not uneven terrain. Is there, like, high places we can put it? Oh, I thought I saw something. Doesn't look like any... Oh, no, there was something around here. I saw it. I, I saw, yeah, around here. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. Maybe it's just because I was going fast. That's very cool. And it seems like we are at high terrain, right? Oh, no, maybe that's just low terrain. Okay, that also makes sense. Sector scanned. Boom. Anomaly found. Select a sector to scan. Right, uh, so scan this sector. Okay, and let's check out this sector. So what, what do we have here? We've got money, right? Uh, rare metals. We're not ready yet to exploit un underground rare metal deposits. When colonists arrive, they'll be able to operate. Okay. We've got another concrete deposit. There's some metals there. Uh, and we've got an anomaly, which we should go check out. Uh, who is our... This guy. Yeah, the explorer. So go check out that anomaly, sir. He's got charge. He should be fine. 
interesting though that we may like lose that kind of thing. The building's not working, but once the sun comes out, oh boy, once the sun comes out, what is that? Oh, pile of resources, okay. I guess we've got so much metal. Where is the... Uh, is there a way to put the resources we have up? Colony overview. Uh, metals, 32. Concrete, food. We do definitely need to get going on food. Don't have any fuel or electronics, but these guys, like, yeah, these guys run off batteries, and we've got a couple of charging stations, so that should be good. Uh, once the power kicks up, We'll have water coming in. <laughs> should have water. It should have power. Grid parameters. Power production. Max power. Power consumption. Total demand. Okay, so we need more power. Uh, is what you're telling me here. So, build another one of these. Shouldn't really build it there. But, you know what? I've built it there. Stop me. So, we'll get some drones doing that. Priority is set from the info panel of the individual buildings and constructions. Okay, so... Uh, info panel. Is that this? Encyclopedia unpinned. Alright. Warning, not enough power. Uh, production. Info panel. Uh... Drones will try to complete higher priority tasks. Buildings with higher priority will receive resources and power in case of okay. So where's the info panel? Change Ah, change priority. So this will get power instead of that. And that's actually perfectly acceptable. So that should now be Yeah, there's some water coming in here, it looks like. Stored water. Lovely. Okay. So next thing we need is probably a f well that needs workers so if we can get the fungal farm maybe how's the research going uh, i mean it's slowly getting there we've got a sponsor which gets us 300 then we've got this thing here as well which is going I wonder if this is multiplayer. Paradox likes to do their multiplayer stuff, doesn't it? So, uh, oxygen can be extracted from the atmosphere by a moxie. Since it's crucial for the survival, an oxygen tank for storage is highly recommended. Pipes are used to connect all life support buildings. Okay, this is this is going to get crabby quickly, isn't it? Okay, so let's get a uh, moxie. there and then we need a oxygen tank or two I say two and we'll put, um, there and anomaly analyzed Anomaly analyzed. New There's text. more to the oh. barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. Ooh, a over. veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. So long as you know where to look. Oh, not all of it. Okay. So, uh, the following texts have been revealed on the research screen. Live from Mars. Uh, low G high rise. Okay. Oh, so is that how you get the... So, low G high-rise is apartments, residential building. I suggest that going to Mars means permanence on the planet, a mission by which we are building up. Okay. And then we got uh, this one too, live from Mars. More applicants will start to appear on Earth. Okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Let's head back to here. 
So we're getting water. We're definitely going to need more power. Um, and probably more batteries. So maybe we can have a battery there as well. And maybe another battery there. Yeah. Those are what these are, right? Stores power, amount of power supplied is limited by the battery's max output. Okay, that's... Uh, what do these take? Uh, they also take polymers, unfortunately. And this guy just takes metal. Okay, cool. So we'll also want to build the pipes. So the pipe... What the hell is the pipe valve? Pipes go to there. That'll fit all of that. That's a lot of metal. If we can indeed... Uh, oh, well. Let's see if we can pick one that's not doing anything. Which possible... What the hell are you doing all the way up there? Interesting. Maybe we need smarter operators? <laughs> um, possibly. How is the scan going of this? 70%, nice, okay. Cool. Getting a lot of nice uh, sun coming in. I like it, I like it. Uh, yeah. I don't know why they wouldn't, uh, you. Can you not? Is this not? So this is a metal deposit. This, is this just rock? Or, huh. So are these just rocks? I guess those are just rocks. How can we tell what a metal deposit looks like? That's probably not the right angle to look at that from. Man, this is, this is like, like just zooming out like that made me go, this is kind of awesome. Okay. So getting our water. How's the stored water going? Okay, that's how much water is stored. Hourly production three, hourly demand, okay. There are our batteries. Not actually that much power stored, currently stored in them. Oh, the music, the, the music's so calm, I love it. I'm not sure it's entirely apropos to, uh, to Mars. I feel sector like scanned, Mars anomaly like, found. Da, 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 Select the sector to scan. So that will unlock research, that will give research, I think. So let's do the give research first. That is a lot of concrete, okay. Uh, scan, there, why not? Let's do these, and then we might go up this way, and yeah. We'll, we'll, do a, we'll do a full square around us and see what we've got near us. So you, because you're not doing anything. Yeah, no, that's, that's very much okay. No, I don't know what you were doing. No, don't do it. Alright. There's a lot of concrete there, but that's it. Uh, fungal farm is not available to us. H is research. I've got to remember that. Okay, we're, we're getting there, though. We're getting closer to low G hydrosynthesis. Should I build a hydroponic farm? It consumes power. Base production consumes water depending on the crop type. I think we should probably build one, right, too far from domes. Well, there are no domes. Oh, do those have to go in domes? Okay. Maybe the fungal farm, check it, maybe the fungal farm doesn't have to be in domes. How cool would that be, right? I wonder if, if you can have things like a war on Earth whereby, like, you know, you're just stuck out here and it's like, ha! Get screwed. Maybe that wouldn't be awesome, but um, it'd be interesting for the game. And you know, be prepared and all that. Uh, so how are you doing over here? Yeah, you're doing alright. Uh, 
can be uh, manual activated to cut off water and oxygen supply. I wonder if that's like a, uh, what's it called? Moisture vaporator. Produces water from the atmosphere. Production lowered when placed near other vaporators. No production during dusts. Okay, we probably don't want to make that just purely because we've got the regular water thing going on. But it's good to know. Uh, let's have another universal demo. Just put that, I guess, there. Uh, that was wrong, but it'll do. Uh, Buildings have shut down because it's night time and we've run out of power. The basic dome. This way, right? Because there's there's not much over this way, aside from there. But the other way we could take it, of course, is up this way, which might actually be a better choice. But we're taking it fairly far away from the power and the uh, and the oxygen and everything. So hourly production, total total demand, stored oxygen, not enough power. Okay. Doesn't produce during dust storms. Uh, homes, education, apartments. Yeah, we, well, we know about that. Provides living space for children. Nah, no children. Desired perks in children using modern remote learning techniques. Ooh. Interesting. Uh, generates research. Yep. Uh, infirmary, space bar. Sorry, I had to. Uh, diner. Open edge. Research complete. No said... active research. Anomaly analyzed. Okay. Uh, water reclamation system. Drastically reduces the water consumption of the dome. Ooh. That's kind of nice. Rock rockets and shuttles require less fuel. We have no fuel available to us, so there is that. Low G high rise. Uh, yeah. I... Oh, did we get that? No, we can't have got that. Uh, increases production, also increases power consumption. We'll put that on the next one, yeah. Okay, so no power at the moment. Seven buildings not working. Anomaly analyzed. And you, I tried to click drag. You can go there. Do we, we, yeah, we have enough power for that. Okay, how's the 40% the right. I wonder if we can tunnel through this. Interesting question. Needs to be answered because this is a uh, water reclamation system. So it looks like there's a fair amount of other stuff going on as well. Here. And like, you know, like more stuff you can get. So an so tunnel. entrance rovers can travel along the tunnels okay so we could put a, like a tunnel entrance here and then a tunnel entrance here for example if there's anything cool here which this seems is this in our oh that's a little bit away from the sector okay because that looks interesting is that like oil or something maybe i don't know what that is it, it seems interesting to me though because i'm a massive loser uh, so which way? I think I think we put the dome here, right? Just because it's convenient, more convenient. So dome, basic dome. Put it not too far away. Like here. And then we'll get uh, power, power cables. We just need to run this to. So we need uh, water uh, pipes. We need a water pipe running to. We should probably do maybe that doesn't work for us. Um, okay, so run it this way. Uh, 
run it to here, and then down to here, and then run this one over here. And that should get us water and oxygen in here. And we've got power going in here as well. We will definitely need power. Now let's have a look at these and see... Basic dog. Right. No. Uh, uh, so wind turbines... It'd probably be worth having some wind turbines. I'm not sure. I saw a... No. I think that's moving it quickly. Goes like, oh yeah, you can build it, but you, you, you can't build it. Yeah, no, I mean, like, it, it, it was flashing right here, but no, no. Okay, so we could build some wind turbines out here. Maybe. Oh, the metal's slightly shiny, I see. Yeah, you can see the difference very slightly. So let's not do that yet. Let's think about the Sterling generator. Anomaly analyzed. Build a couple of those. There's more to the barren environs of the Red Planet than meets the eye. A veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. So long as okay. you know where to look. Same thing they said the first time, I think. Uh, so we got hydro... Hy hy hygroscopic vaporators. Sounds like something peachy with you. Um, water production is increased by 50%. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, polymers. Harvested by drones or RC transports. Okay. RC transport. Let's see how this fares, right? Let's take that to there and go get those resources. Sorry, my uh, my S uh, really um. Some polymers, concrete. My yeah, my S is there went for a little bit, but uh, we're fine. We're fine. So can we produce drones here? Set a custom name. I'm two, sue me. Um, launch, can't launch. Allow for bid, not doing that. Change priority, not doing that. Service area is fine. Status, refueling. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Select a sector to scan. Okay. Uh, no resources there, just uh, anomaly. Okay, I don't really want to scan that. But let's scan all of these, right? Yeah. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, so I think, guys, what we'll do is on my seven day series, we'll probably just carry this on from where it is. Uh, or should we start again? Okay, yeah, let, let's, we'll, we'll, we'll start again. I was thinking about, uh, but honestly, the seven day series is going to be enough time uh, to check out the game. And we may even, I think, mm, okay, yeah, let's not, let's not even do a seven day series, a seven D series. Let's not even do a seven day series. We'll just, uh, we'll just go with like a full on series, I think. So that's the RC Rover. Where's our... Is he still down here? He is still down here. I think he's got enough battery to do this. Let's try. If you don't try, you don't know. And we'll learn for the series. So yeah, I think I, I'm, I'm very much down with let's just do a proper series on this. Because this is such a cool game. I'm going to want to play for more than seven episodes, right? So we may as well do a proper full-on series. And most likely, um, uh, one thing I do need to say 
Uh, and I don't think it matters when I see it. Uh, I got a key for this uh, from the devs. Uh, so there's that out the way, so you guys know. I don't really feel like it makes much of a difference, you know. Um, but those are the rules, so you've got to follow the rules. Um, I got a key from the devs, uh, and we have, like, a set date. Like, apparently some people are allowed to to do stuff on it early, which is why you may have already seen videos on this. Um, you know, uh, rich keep getting richer, as, uh, people like to say. Um, but yeah, uh, what, what it will be is basically, okay, those are connected, good. Those are connected too? Yeah, those are connected too. Um, I just wanted to make sure. What, what it, what it will probably be, uh, is we'll, we'll have, we'll, we'll, I'll record a fair amount of a series for this before I'm allowed to start putting it out. Uh, because you're allowed to do, you know, basic videos and then, you know, review videos. It, it's kind of standard stuff. Um, I, I'm, obviously I'm not going to do a review on this. I don't do reviews. Uh... I have said I enjoy this game so far, but it's like initial impressions, like, I like the look of this game, kind of thing. It's it's not like a glowing recommendation or anything. And I'll try to keep my ecstatic Paradox fanboy Enos um, away from you guys as much as possible. I don't want to infect you with that. Um, but I, th I, think, I think we're going to have a lot of fun with this, uh, with this series. Yeah, yeah. Alright. So expect, uh, I, mm, I don't want to do the like, you know, uh, and also because there have been other YouTubers who've already done series for these, I don't feel like there's a need to, you know, really grab people's attention by putting multiple videos out on the same day to begin with, you know, because uh, you guys have probably already seen this if you're interested in it. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll do a video a day and uh, I'll probably put it in the 8.30 slot, which is where... that That's actually where the... Um, what are they called? That, that's where the 7-day series have been going. But I can switch the 7-day series to being earlier. Because uh, I'm, I'm perfectly happy with that. So that's probably what we'll do. I don't know what I'm going to do for the next 7-day series either. I'll have to have a little look around and see if there's if there's some appropriate ones. Let's, uh, we've got a little bit of time uh, left in the video. I, I like to make these videos an hour long. I feel like first look tutorial Breakthrough gameplay. Breakthrough discovered. Oh, hull polarization. Oh. Buildings require maintenance, less option, less option, less often. So I guess, is that from this here? Yeah, okay, that's from this here. Wait, I am bad at this. Okay, so come home. I don't think they can recharge there. How can they recharge? Is it with this? No. RC Rover, yep, yep, yep. Uh, so, recharge. Oh, what's this? Create transport route. Selected resource will be collected near the origin point. Okay. Unload resources. Unload resources. It's not carrying any resources, okay. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Uh, we don't have any polymers here. What happened to those polymers? Did I not pick them up? I'm starting to kind of see how this works now as well. So I, I haven't made the best of starts here, which is, you know, it's fine. But we're, we're speeding this up. So need to scan. Oh, it's still scanning these sectors. Okay. So we found 
metals in here. Don't know where. I guess just like sitting about. Maybe like yeah, some metals there. Okay. I actually that I think that's all of the metals that we found. A cargo rocket uh, can deliver additional supplies for the colonies, for example, advanced resources such as polymers. Open the resupply UI. Resupply UI. Uh, select a cargo rocket and load the desired payload up to the rocket's capacity and your available funding. Plan carefully, you have a limited number and travel times are significant. Okay, so cargo rocket. Prefab buildings, that's always good. Uh, Okay, so we can make like drone hubs and moisture fuel, 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 produces fuel from water. That would be useful to have. And there's our funding. Let's get two. Machine part factory. Oh. Produces polymers from water and fuel. Oh, and that's all we can take. Okay, and now we can't take any of these. Orbit Pro. Okay. Launch. That's not this rocket, right? Uh, okay, so I guess the rocket's coming. It doesn't actually tell you that the rocket's coming. But I'm guessing that it's coming. How's this doing? We've got all the poly... Ah, oh, maybe that's where the polymers went. Maybe it delivered the polymers to there. Okay. So that's all charged up. That is not... Recharged. Cable fault reported. Okay, malfunctioning cables. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. No resources in that, in that one either. Huh. Okay, so that, that uh, cable's being fixed, which is good. Oh. So we're scanning this sector, then we've got that sector and that sector, and then I think we should go this way afterwards. Sector scanned. Okay, nothing. some concrete. Oh, there we go. There's some underground metals. Nice. And that's all of our orbital scanners, I guess. Uh, which is fine because, uh, wait, what's this? Trust. Anomaly analyzed. Oh, there's our cargo rocket. New text. What is that? Uh, I saw that. Sneak. We still need more concrete. So maybe like another couple of concrete things here would be good if we were doing, you know. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Got a lot of water there, actually. That's good. And they found more metal to burn, yeah. Which is good for them. Uh, new techs are available. So, There's okay. more to the barren environs of the red Ooh, planet than meets the eye. Decommission a veritable. What do we got here? Soil adaptation. Decommission. You know what we should actually do is we should. Uh, no, 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 no. There you go. Yeah. Sorry about that. Uh, we should look at this and do the fungal farm. So it needs a cable connection. But we could. So like there. Yeah, okay. So if we, if we just plop that down there, what do we need for that? Concrete, metals, and electronics. Okay. Okay. So the electronics are our baby. Uh, electronics. The rover done. manipulators held the silver-white mineral up to the camera just as the chemical analysis came through. We found tellurium. 
Uh, oh, in a moment, the chief engineer at Mission Control was at the communications station, urging instructions to the RCA Explorer how to handle and analyze the discovery. It was amusing to watch the almost childlike excitement in the eyes of the expert. This is a significant discovery because it allows us to overcome an old problem in metallurgy. Easily machinable metals allow for e economic manufacturing of components, but the factors that allow it usually lower their performance vice versa. Thus, the engineers had always been challenged to find ways to balance the two factors. The addition of tellurium to iron alloys allowed them to perform better in both areas. Effect. The, uh, the technologies of robotics tree gain a 10% boost. Oh. That's lovely. Let's go check out this anomaly. So yeah, we, look, we, you can see like... I think maybe this landing spot, we should have landed... Ah, uh, but... Ah, uh, but no, but yeah, but no, but no, but no, but no, but... Robot, robot, robot. Okay, so we've got this guy ready to land. So what we could actually do is, Sector like, scanned. land them somewhere else. There's a dust storm. We could, like, land it somewhere else. And then start a new thing. Okay, that's kind of useful. Breakthrough discovered. Superconducting computer. Oh, that's this. Uh, converts unused power into research points. Ooh. Okay, yeah, yeah, this is... I was hoping to get this bloody dome built, but the concrete's being a bit lame. Uh, let's give it a few more moops. Uh, that's moments in uh, uh, a language that doesn't exist. Um, how are we doing here? We're waiting for concrete. Okay, that's uh, low priority though. We need the concrete here. Okay. So we're getting concrete. It's taking time, but we're getting concrete. Status maintenance needed. Research complete. Uh, low G high rise. Cool. Uh, now we're doing. Physics. How's our power grid looking? Uh, power production 40, max 40 power consumption. Okay, yeah, our, our power is fine, it looks like. And. Oh, so these rise as they store more. That's really cool way to indicate that. And these were okay. Sector yeah, scanned. Anomaly found. Uh, okay, where was that? That was like there. Yeah. All right. So we've got other places with water. We've got other places with concrete. Uh, is that metal? No, but that is. Yeah. Do that, my apologies. Many, many apologies. Not that much metal, so probably finding the oh, that's actually lowering as we as we gather the concrete. That's going down. That's really cool. That's just like a like a little thing that I actually really enjoy. Um, okay, seventy three out of eighty. Ah, uh, that's, that's fine. I think our power will last through. Yeah, we've actually got enough power in these two sterling generators. It doesn't tell me what a sterling... I want to know what a sterling generator is. Generates power. While closed, the generator is protected from dust, but produces less power. It doesn't tell me what it is, though. Ah, I want to know what it is. So we're almost there on concrete. Just gotta build it. Okay. Cool. 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 There we go. So let's, uh, yeah, this is gonna get built fairly quickly, it looks like. 
There we go. Milestone achieved. Sector scanned. Okay, so what we want to do is we want some living quarters. Ah, that makes sense. So we put some living quarters in. Some apartments in if we like. Yeah, sure, some apartments. Oh, and they even go inside. That's cool. I mean, that's all right, I guess. Whatever. You know, who, who cares, really? Then we can put, like, a nursery in and a, and a playground in and a school in. Oh, God. And a school in and a research lab in. Oh, that can go there. Yeah, put the research lab next to the nursery and the playground. It's not that we're taking kids from these places and then turning them into research. We're just performing experiments. It's just experiments on them. It's cool. They, they have a fun time. They enjoy themselves. It's fine. Okay. Sanity. Comfort. Oh, 14. Oh, va 14 vacant. Yeah. Filter by traits. Open quarantine. Cable fault reported. Right, that's fine. Uh, how do we get people? Launched a rocket from Mars. First human on Mars. First Martian born. Evaluation scan of sectors. Constructed a mega zone. Constructed a wonder. Sweet. Sweet. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. So I guess what we should have done is we should have requested a rocket, but with people. So let's see how this fungal farm does. Uh, put this in high priority. Does that keep the priority? No, it doesn't keep the priority. That's good. When you're ready, you can invite launch a passenger rocket from Earth and land it near one of your domes. The rocket will carry some food supplies, but you have to secure power, oxygen, water, living space, and other parts. Okay, so rocket, passenger rocket, uh, age group. Specialization. I launch. It's not important for this one, but I will look into that probably in the next one. Okay, we want to build this. Why aren't we building this? We need electronics and we don't have electronics. Ah, well, then we won't be building that. Alright, that, that should be good enough for, for this episode, I think. It gives you an idea of the game. And then uh, probably... Probably a few hours after this video is out, there will be the first episode of Surviving Mars, the Let's Play, the series, I, I don't know exactly what I'm going to call it, we'll, we'll figure it out. We've got a little bit of time for me to figure it out, so, uh, so, thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, it always helps out a lot, and of course I do really appreciate it. Uh, link in description to all my stuff, you know, Discord, Patreon, all that kind of stuff, uh, and I will see you on Mars. No, I'll see you in the next one.